Good morning, it's day 222 and I've just woken up in Gemma's mum's bed. Do you let go of me so I can get up please? <laughs> morning Gemma, morning Lauren. Morning. <laughs> Beverly's blind because she hasn't got her contact lenses in, can't see anything. <laughs> What's that? When Ben visits, you Everyone's downstairs. Gemma, I need a pair of socks. Get me a pair of socks now. Ah, oh, socks. Hi Ben, how you doing you lazy dick? Breakfast time! So where are we going for breakfast? We'll try ferns. Okay. Yesterday evening we came down this subway, there's some amazing graffiti down here. It's not specifically graffiti, it's more like kids have drawn it. Have a look at it all, it's absolutely brilliant, it's like four year olds have done it. Amazing! Look at the big head! The pink man! And it's nice to see that the uh, images are non-discriminatory. There's a sign back there somewhere scrawled saying uh, artwork in progress. But personally I think it's the best subway art I've ever seen. Well done Essex. We're in Exeter. Essex. <laughs> Do you live in Essex or Exeter? Exeter, you Oh, sorry. <laughs> Although if you've heard about Essex girls, she does suit the Essex sort of. There's somewhere else called the Real McCoy that do all day breakfasts. We're going here. Ooh, it's nice in here. Hey, this is really cool. We've got uh, vinyl for placemats. I've got uh, Lionel Richie. Hello. I just had one of the nicest breakfasts I ever remember in here. I'm not kidding. That real McCoy cafe just there has made me want to stay in Exeter another night. It's lovely. Guess what? Beverly just bought a brand new dress. You better put it on then. The Masonate has gone into Primark to try it on, but she's been in there about 20 minutes. Come on, girl. What on earth could she be doing in there? Uh, I know what she was doing in there. She came out, she bought me stuff, loads of pairs of pants. <laughs> See, she bought me cheeky monkey pants. <laughs> and even so, she's headed back in to get changed again. Oh, here she comes with her lovely dress. Got her legs out. Take your coat off, you look pretty. Twelve. <laughs> ah, they've got a shake away in Exeter as well. I'm going to have to go and buy a Dave because I like Dave's and I like my mate Dave. Have you seen shakeaways before? They're really cool. They do all sorts of different milkshakes. Gemma, would you like to suck some Dave? Look, it's not just me that likes them. They're number one in the top ten milkshakes here. A normal Dave, please. A normal Dave. Well, I've got my Dave. No spinning. I'm not spinning. But this lot playing foosball. You four get so aggressive. It's terrible. <laughs> Where are we going now? The Apple Store. We're back in the Apple store and I'm still considering the iPad, but I don't think Real Director works properly on it, so I'm not sure about it yet. I really want one, but it's got to be justified and they can't install it on one of these iPads here for me, so I'm not going to buy one. If they did, I'd buy one just for the sake of it, but no, moody pants. That's a pretty big deal. They should have just paid £2.99 or £2.39, whatever it is, installed it so I'd buy it, but no. Oh dear, it's raining. Look at that little girl with the umbrella. It's funny. Ah, I swear it was sunny 20 minutes ago. What happened? England! Well, I guess it's time to go home now. A storm's arriving. And the sad thing is, we've still yet to find Gemma and Man. It's like Bev's found someone new, though. Look, guys, later on, I'm planning something. I want to see you arm wrestle Lauren. I think it's going to be a great competition. I'm at Parliament Street, and guess what Parliament Street is? Apparently, one of the smallest streets in the world. So here we go, let's check it out. Right at the end, there's Lauren, look. We're gonna walk all the way to the end. It gets thinner, and steeper, and smaller. Oh, it's getting really thin. Ah. Ah. Jesus, it's really skinny here. Yeah? See, narrowest in the world. Narrowest street in the world. I said I would. You had to walk around, didn't you, Ben? <laughs> 
Okay, okay, you can just about fit through. I can't believe you're trying on another dress. But it does look nice. You're going to buy it. Hello. Beverly, how much money have you spent on dresses today? <laughs> City centre that way, we've just been there. Key, five minutes this way. That's where we're going to go. Why are you girls going all lesbian on me? What are you doing? Don't like this, Ben. Oh, this is pretty lovely down here. I've never been to Exeter before. I do like it a lot. So there's a lovely little river. There's people with canoes on it, boats and stuff. Everyone will go around on bikes. I think we'll stick around here just a little longer before we head home. And of course, I've promised all my viewers that you're going to arm wrestle Lauren. We'll do that later. We're all getting on a pedalo and Ben and Gemma are going to do the steering and the pedaling. That one there. Bye, 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 Lauren. Bye. Ah, I must say this was pretty nice being chauffeured around by them two skanks. This is brilliant. We're going towards this bridge and there's hundreds of swans. Gemma, head towards the swans. Okay. Do you mind pedalling faster, please? You a man or a mouse? That is fascinating. Look. Hello, Mr. Swan. Look at them all. Swans are vicious. Be careful. That's a lot of fun for £1.25 each. We're just heading back in now where Lauren's waiting. Here we come. Hi, Lauren. Thanks, that was fun. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> thanks. We missed you on our intrepid voyage down the Exeter River. Aww. Uh, we're going to go home because we're spending too much money. Well, I'm not, but they are. We're going to eat at home, I think. It's six o'clock, it's coming to the end of a really nice day and we've got a rainbow over there in Exeter. Gorgeous. I like the name of this shop. Back to home sweet home. That scene looks quite familiar. I think someone's getting their hair done coloured. What colour are you getting done? Blue. <laughs> Make sure she ends up looking like a Smurf, please. Come on, Gemma Pie. Get it all out. <laughs> Is that Gemma Tremlett? Come down into the light, I want to see you properly. Wow, Gemma Tremlett, you've gone all goth on us. That's cool. Can't call you Ginger anymore, can we? And Beverly's got a new dress on as well. It's been a proper girly video today, hasn't it? Oh, it's a bit dark out now. We've decided to go back out to the beach to have some fish and chips. Well, just chips for me. <laughs> Gemma's taken the dress off, but it's still got blue on. Wow! It's a cracking sky out tonight. <coughs> Apparently, we're going to a beach in Exmouth. <laughs> oh dear, it's a bit too dark to be going down the beach, and it's too dark to be filming my video as well. So where's this, Gemma? Is this the seafront in Exmouth? Yep. Cool. Let's just hope the fish and chip shop's open because I'm pretty friggin' hungry. I haven't eaten since breakfast. Ow. Hooray, we found a place that's open. This looks all right. Anything else, mate? Yeah. We've ordered so many portions of chips we cause a famine in Ireland. <laughs> and there's one more thing we've got to do. We've got to find somewhere we can get them to arm wrestling. Gemma, you're so spooky with dark hair. <laughs> I got myself a pickled egg. They got battered sausages. It's really late now, it's half past nine, it's really dark out, but we're gonna sit and look over the sand dunes and eat our fish and chips. Well, here we are overlooking the sea. I won't bother showing you because it's too dark and the iPhone can't handle that. How are you kids doing? Squash there in the back, good, yeah? Je suis fini. I don't think I ordered a big enough portion. This is no good, it's just too dark to carry on with my video. I'm gonna finish it up here. It's day 222 of 365. We're still in Exeter, well, Exmouth at the moment, but we'll be here again tomorrow because <laughs> we're gonna stay around Gemma's. Uh, so stick around, see if Gemma changes her hair color again, and I'll speak to you then. Bye. Aha, you don't think I forgot, did you? Yeah. Right, we're gonna get these two kids arm wrestling. My money's on Lauren. <laughs> I, I... One, go! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Ben, you should be doing it much easier than that. I'd like to commend you on nearly beating a man that's five years older than you. And you, you're pathetic. 